Okay, World Music, I love these guys. You may not have heard of them, but you probably have heard their sounds. They're the new producers on the block, and they're forever working hard to find those new beats. I am exclusive in the DNK studios. Lego. Kia ora. Now, we have the privilege of hanging out with DNK World Music. Yeah. Kia ora, guys. Kia ora. Describe your sound. It actually doesn't start until you got the artist. So obviously we got Ricky here, um, got Darnell. Um, the reason why we got them is because they're quite unique themselves. You know, they don't rap like ordinary New Zealand rappers that you hear every day. That's the first thing that starts with the, our sound. I'm quite unique with the sounds. He's the most out of it guy I've ever hooked up with in music because like his brain is like, you got like 10 orchestras in his head. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's that's yeah. how his brain functions when it comes to beat making. <laughs> And I think for me, like me, when it comes to lyric and melody, like um, like I have a different way of how he thinks. Yeah, yeah. And I think when we gel our, our minds together, it's kind of like, yeah. it's kind of like, you know, um, Captain Planet has got the five rings and <laughs> Captain Planet comes out, you know? <laughs> There's a serious song on here that has been in my mind ever since I listened to the CD, and I'm sure you guys too, and I know you know what I'm talking about, though. I'm rocking with my skinny jeans, no one keep a fresh, huh? Skinny jeans. Skinny jeans. Okay, oh. hey, skinny jeans is dangerous. It calls blindness to those who see the skinny jeans, and in some cases, I'm sure, infertility, because they're so tight. Why would you write a song about skinny jeans, though? <laughs> The whole thing about it is like, you know, because I'm not like a gangster. We're, we're not yeah, gangsters we're not or gangsters. anything. We're not and I hate people putting rap into a gangster perception. Yeah. Like wearing your pants down to your knees that are like three times is too big for you and stuff. It's a new, new. You know, the kids out there uh, yeah, wearing them, they're rocking them. I see, I see that all the time. Like me and Ricky just went shopping the other day and we saw like two of these dudes skating in, in, <clears throat> in Auckland City and they're rocking skinnies and they're like, hey, you guys sing their skinny jeans songs. We love skinny jeans. <laughs> It's working somehow, you know, yeah. so... And it yeah. got in your head. Yeah. It got in your head. <laughs> so yeah, 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 yeah. Now your videos are different, they don't go down the usual track of, I don't know, girls, booties, that type of thing. If you're gonna go out and do this, like, you know, five chicks in bikinis and stuff, you know, what if that's your mum, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, or what if, that's your, what if that's your sister, you know, is that your sister in your video clip? Cause, cause you know, you're like, oh hell no, you know? You're not taking my little sister, you gotta put her in a video clip. If you do something that's not you, it's you're not gonna go anywhere. Yeah. So yeah. that's why we don't we stay away from that. Like, if if you're a gangster, you, you can do it, but there's no point in us talking yeah. about it. So we just do what we know. Who are the artists that you've sort of worked with through your label, or just worked with? We work with also like Peter T, which is uh, which is on the album as well. Like Priscilla, which is a cool one. Um, Jay Williams, Ron Artis, yeah. Fat Joe. Yeah, pretty much like a whole list of them. But now you're Facebook buddies and got <clears throat> hookups with the old bro Ron Artis. So yeah, no, Ron Artis. Are you gonna? How are you gonna sort of keep that that a whole warm with that guy? Big artists are always looking for those hip beats, mm. and so it's a matter of finding those hip beats. And, um, and 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 what you got to realize is that like hip, hip music takes a lot of time. It, you know, sometimes you can come over overnight, but you know most of the time you got to like work on it. And so at the moment, like we've got the working relationship of you know <clears throat> beat back and forth, music back and forth. Yeah. He makes the music, and yeah. you know I do the communication. See, well, you guys, if you haven't already got it yet, you need to get this because yeah. it's a good album. It's a really good album. Yeah, you got it. I have five, five copies.